And topping today's health news, encouraging findings about the benefit of a newer approach in reducing the risk of cardio cardiovascular events. Local 10 medical specialist Christy Kruger has details in our HealthCast. Well, the latest research looked at using an injectable drug called Repatha to help statin therapy work a whole lot better. Researchers found that the combined approach reduced the risks of things like heart attacks and strokes by 20 percent. Dr. Seth Baum says the findings are significant for us right here in South Florida, where nearly 25 percent of adults ages 65 and older have been diagnosed with heart disease. The problem we're finding is that we prescribe the drug, we do it on label, and the insurance providers uh, oftentimes will deny the drug. And so this has become, and has been since the start, a, a huge impediment for us to access the drug for our patients. Dr. Baum says Repatha is especially beneficial for people with a history of cardiovascular disease or those with a genetic predisposition to high cholesterol who are unable to lower their levels of bad cholesterol with statins alone. And when it comes to heart disease risk among women, a recent study reveals a new possible warning sign, those dreaded hot flashes. The study looked at women between the ages of 40 and 60 who did not smoke and had no history of cardiovascular disease. Researchers found that women who experience hot flashes between the ages of 40 to 53 had a higher risk of heart disease later on. The study suggests that young women with hot flashes may have poor vascular functioning, which could have a negative effect on your heart. With your HealthCast today, I'm Christy Krueger.